Let's pin, shall we? Yes, let's pin. How do you pin? If you are brand new to marketing your business on Pinterest, you probably are wondering the very basic step of how to actually get pins onto Pinterest. Pin with me. Let's get some pins on Pinterest using both desktop and mobile. I'll show you how to do both. Well, hello there, it's Tabby with Simple Pin Media and we are here to help you effectively market your business on Pinterest. First, let me tell you that it is much easier to pin, schedule your pins, all of those things, manage your Pinterest account on your desktop, whether it be a laptop or a big old fat desktop. Definitely easier to do that than to try to do it on mobile. When you want to use mobile with your Pinterest management is when you are creating an idea pin. You can also create and publish idea pins on your desktop, but there are some features that are not available on desktop that are available on mobile. So you can kind of think of idea pins as more of the kind of social media side of Pinterest. And that makes sense because on Instagram, TikTok, all of those things are much easier on your mobile device. But when it comes to standard pins, video pins, getting those on your Pinterest account and getting them scheduled, that's all going to be easier to do on desktop. Let's look at how to post a pin on Pinterest or publish a pin on Pinterest. Okay, so first you're going to open up your Pinterest account. You're gonna go up and hit create and hit create pin. This is where you're gonna add all your info. Right here is where you would grab your image that you already have created. It can either be a pin, standard pin image or a video pin. So here I'm grabbing the pin image that I wanna to use today. And now I'm going to add the pin title. And you want this to be keyworded. Usually two to four words typically is what you're gonna use. And then you're gonna add the description. This is where you want it to be keyworded in sentence form. And then I'm adding alt text. And this is to be inclusive for anybody who has impairments. I'm just describing what's on the image. Then I am grabbing the link where I want the user to go when they click on the pin. So here you can either select publish now or you can select publish later. And this is really Pinterest scheduling feature. So if you're trying to save money and not pay for a scheduling tool like Tailwind or Planoly, then you can just use Pinterest and you can schedule out. It only allows you to schedule out about a month. So I'm just going to set a date. I'm not gonna worry about the time right now, but you can select different times. And then if you have products, if you have a shop on your Pinterest account, you can tag your products. Or if you have affiliate links, you can tag those products. So you just click on the image of your pin and then you can drop that URL in this section. And then I just click on the image and there it is, it's tagged. And you can tag multiple products so for this pin in particular, we do have many different types of template packages that you can get. So I'm just gonna stop there for now, but I could tag even more than that. So then this is where you will add the board that you want this pen to go to. And you can hit publish. And since I had it scheduled, it will be set to schedule. But let's say you want to pin this same pin to other relevant boards that you have. You're just gonna click on those three dots, hit duplicate, and then you're gonna have that same exact pin with the title, description, everything. However, if you want to schedule that for a specific another date, you're gonna have to take those tags off and then schedule that pin and then add your tags back in. Let's say you have other pins to pin, you can just hit that plus sign and you can continue to pin more. So for instance, for this pin, I want to link out to one of our YouTube videos. So I'm going to add that YouTube video pin 
and then I'm going to add the title, description, all of those things, and then at the link, the destination link, I'm going to link to that YouTube video. And again, you can choose publish now, publish later, make sure you choose the right board you want it to go to. You can either hit publish for each individual one, or you can hit those little circle check marks off to the side there and you can publish multiple at one time. For example's sake, I'm going to go ahead and hit publish on the one that I scheduled just so you can see what that looks like. So I hit publish and here you can see that it will publish on the date that I set it for. Okay, so we pin some pins on desktop. There are ways that you can schedule it. There are ways you can pin multiple pins to several different boards all at once. Now you know how to do that. Up next, I want to show you how to post a pin using your phone. So again, this is really not that easy to do. It's really if like you are out somewhere, maybe you're on vacation and you realize that you didn't publish a pin that has new content that is relevant for that season and you really want to get it out there and you can just like do it on your phone real quick. So let me show you how to do that. So obviously you're going to open up your Pinterest app, hit the plus sign at the bottom and hit pin. Now, just like on desktop, you can either add a static image or you can add a video pin. So I'm going to add the same image that I had on before. I'm gonna hit next. And this is where you want to add your title, obviously. And you're going to grab the link. And this is where you can either publish now or schedule it. To schedule it, you're going to hit the little pencil icon, pick a day you want it to go out. You can pick your time, whatever that is. Done. Add your alt text. I'm not going to do that right now for time's sake. So I'm going to hit next. And then you're going to pick your board here. So now it is scheduled, it popped up, said it's scheduled for the date that I selected. Boom. And so this is actually where, if you go under your created tab, this is where you will see your scheduled pins at the top here. So just keep in mind, if you have a pin that you want to tag products on and you do it on your mobile device, you're not gonna be able to tag your products while you're publishing it, you know, get, putting all of that information in. You're not gonna be able to do that then. But once it is published, you can go back to that pin and edit the pin and then add your tags. However, you can't do that on mobile. So if you do publish your pin using your mobile device and you wanna add tags, you're gonna to have to go onto your desktop or laptop, go back to that pin, hit the three little dots and edit the pin, and then you can add your tags. So what about those schedulers? We love schedulers here at Simple Pin. We use Tailwind the most. We also use Later and Planoly. Tailwind has the best feature as far as being able to schedule a pin and have it go to all of its relevant boards at an interval. So like I could take one pin, schedule it to all the relevant boards with a, let's say a four day interval, meaning that pin will go out to different boards every four days. Makes life so easy, but that does cost money. It costs extra money to pay for a scheduling tool. And depending on what package you get, there's various price ranges. I will leave some of our affiliate links below to a couple of the scheduling tools that we like to recommend or use just to give you some options if you want them. It just really makes your life a lot easier. If you're creating content at least once a week and you are creating two to three pin images for each piece of content, probably you will want to 
eventually, if not now, invest in a good scheduler so that you are staying consistent on the Pinterest platform. This way, you don't have to go into your Pinterest account every single day to pin those same pins over and over and over again. It's a real time suck if you do that really truly is. So for me, I schedule our simple pin account every week. Every Thursday I go in and I schedule out each day. So each day I have about, gosh, I can't remember, 10 or 15 (laughs) pins per day are being pinned, are being posted on our Pinterest account. And it's because I scheduled those And I only do that once a week. That's it, guys. It's really easy. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. I am here to answer them. I promise you I will answer your questions. And if you want to learn more about how pin distribution works on Pinterest, how to get seen on Pinterest, watch this video next. See you guys next week.